Thanks for joining us for another tip and two from Koopman Lumber on seeding your lawn. Soil condition is a key in growing any grass. For a lawn seeding success, the soil should be rich in organic material, well aerated, at a desirable pH, and must be free of thatch. Koopman Lumber offers rental equipment to help you start your lawn off right. See our rental pages for video demonstrations on all our lawn enhancement equipment. First of all, seed to soil contact is a must in seeding your lawn. If the seed cannot touch the soil, the seed cannot germinate. Raking is a good way to go, but a dethatcher is fast and efficient. Aerators are a great way to quickly and effectively relieve some of the soil's compactness. Grass roots can spread easier in looser soil and well aerated soil provides a better home for seeds to start off. Plus, Koopman's aerators pull up soil and spread it on the surface, enhancing that critical seed to soil contact. Starter fertilizers, like the new seeding fertilizer here from Jonathan Green, significantly help jumpstart a seed's germination and initial growth. Avoid high nitrogen content fertilizer to prevent burning your young grass. Phosphate is what the new plants need to grow strong roots. Add Magical or Lime to adjust pH as needed, but don't use any weed or insect controls for several weeks prior to seeding. Soil temperature must be approximately 55 degrees Fahrenheit or more, and this means in the spring you have to wait till the forsythia blooms. That will give you an indication of when you can plant the seed. The grass you choose must receive the appropriate amount of sunlight. So choose, there's sun and shade, there's full sun, there's shade blends, Make sure you pick the right one for your conditions. When selecting a seed, make sure the blend has mostly perennial seed in it, unless you just need a fast germination for temporary soil retention. Annual grass seed will germinate fast, but will grow for only one season. Remember, you can never get a great lawn from inferior seed, so we recommend using the seed that turf growers use, Jonathan Green. They are the seed experts. Watering should start light and frequent at the beginning just getting the soil moist a couple times a day through the full germination period. Gradually reduce the frequency and increase the amount after the seeds germinate so that the roots will learn to grow deep into the soil to reach water. Avoid watering in the afternoon and evening hours as that will tend to breed fungus. Thanks for joining us for another Koopman Tip and Two on Seeding Your Lawn.